getting ready to head out to the blind. It's going to be real fun this morning, I think. I'm back in Texas, and I'm pretty happy to be doing my first duck hunt. I'm fortunate to have a good friend who really knows his way around duck hunting. <laughs> Ladies all pumped up to go hunting. What's that? Or directly from your powder flask. No. I was so confused. It's like, where do you get all these wasps? Oh, yeah. You work on a roof every day. <laughs> where do wasps like to hang out? Eaves of roofs. There's the second one over there. Okay. Yeah, okay, so we do have two dead on the water. One on the water. Hey man, what do you think so far? Fucking mega. Fucking mega. I don't know how I fucking missed this bird here, but I realized my gun was down. <laughs> That was fucking quick and fast, man. That's usually how it goes. Yeah, it's probably a lot over, isn't it? <laughs> well, well, we'll stick around, obviously. But. Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah. So we went out this morning. I had a little bit of camera difficulty with with my uh, camera because, wow. Well, it was mounted a little upside down. Yeah. And well, the mount was actually pressing the buttons on us. Exactly. So, so it kept yeah. on like messing up or whatever. But we got a few we got a few ducks this morning. It didn't cause us to miss any birds. No, we didn't. They sat right birds. there on the water and waited until you decided to fuck the camera. <laughs> We're pretty gonna shoot some birds. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So we got a couple uh well why don't you show me these ducks because these are ducks that I'm not necessarily familiar with. I don't really see these ducks at home. So all right, cool. So right here we've got uh four gadwall and one widgeon. So from right to left we've got three Drake Gadwall two hen gadwall and one hen widgeon and this was the shot of the day i think dan dropped this one at about 50 yards he's gonna get away from us and he will he change that bird's mind <laughs> these are the pretty pretty much the most common ducks we see down here uh where in most of the country you know it's green heads all day long we're ecstatic if we see a, a, a single mallard even if it's a susie you know come in but um these make up for it for sure they decoy in perfectly like they're on a kite string every single bird we shot was coming into the hole committed um and what would it take us 15 minutes to set up this morning put the blind covers on it didn't take very long it was actually really sweet put out the two two spinning wing decoys one in the water one on a pole and it seemed to work but it, it's been like this all year where there's a light switch that flips on about five minutes before shoot time which is a half hour before legal shooting light and it flips off about 20 minutes later and it's just dead um we had like but, one come by at like nine o'clock and it just was kind of like a prayer shot yeah i actually got that one on my other camera but i don't know if i'll even be able to find it because it's just like a quick little thing yeah yeah we were we were out of the blind at the time taking a break 
and we had talked about it before the best duck call is not being ready and i look up and that's a duck isn't it and you know i scrambled to grab my gun but that bird was not did not even didn't even try to land it knew that the, the jig was up so um that's okay so yeah. maybe a little later we might go out and go try to jump shoot one on, on his pond yep. and then maybe later uh we might sit out for the evening and see if some ducks come in but we might do some other things too we don't we haven't quite decided what we're going to do yet tonight nice nice fatty birds soon after we got back i went out here and jump shot one off this dock tank i didn't get that on camera it was a beautiful gad wall that I'm going to have mounted. Our new evening spot. We sat for a few hours and nothing else came in. It wasn't too upsetting because I still had one more hunt left. Oh, slow day of duck hunting. I'm really glad that yesterday we got our shooting in because there are no ducks flying. We've seen four today. Yeah. Two, well, we saw a couple flights that just went by. Yeah. It looked like there was a group of teal that went over early. Two landed over yeah. there. But it was before the shooting time. I tried to jump them and they got up and away. Didn't want to shoot towards the dog. And kind of lost yeah. them in the trees. The first and then there's another stock tank over there that I went over to go try jump shooting. And out of the field, it looked like a couple more ducks got up over there. That's all we really saw. Maybe there was one more flight that came over first thing. Maybe, but not nothing that actually came in. And nothing that came anywhere near us. And it wasn't. It wasn't even shooting light yet. Yeah. It stayed dark later this morning too, despite no cloud cover. So yeah. The, you know, there's also almost no moon. Oh well, another day. Can't kill him from the couch. Yep. All right. Well, it was nice though. <laughs>